Hello everyone, it's Thomas Jujubi, and welcome to the 400 subscriber special where I'm answering the questions you left me in the announcement video. So let's look at them. The Helmets and Henshin Network says, Keep at it, my man. I will. Thank you. Weeaboo Hub says, When are we going to see the face reveal? Well, I'll get to the face reveal once I get to the face reveal. <laughs> Uh, um, but, but joking aside, I think that by the end of the year, I will have done a face reveal, but don't count on that. But I, I think probably by the end of this year, I will have shown my face on camera. The Black Knight says, best character from Transformers Prime. So honestly, favorite character, like, I like all the characters from Prime, but I haven't seen Prime in a while. So I can't really maybe specifically say who my favorites are. But, like, off the top of my head, I'd say it's probably Ratchet from the Autobots and then Soundwave from the Decepticons. There's, there's no one else turning to Decepticons that anyone would like, right? Juicy. Invicticus V3 says, I have one question and one question only. How do you become so elite? I don't know. You tell me how I became so elite. Pookiecrafter817 asks, Do you think that newer episodes of Power Rangers should cover topics for an older demographic like the newest episode of Super Ninja Seal where Calvin thought Haley was cheating on him? That's that's quite an interesting question. My answer is what I normally say for stuff like that, which is pretty much yes. I would like to see that if they do it right. Because the idea of cheating in that episode was interesting that I don't think has been done before in Power Rangers. And it could have been cool and done really well. But they really didn't do it well, and because of that, it just kind of fell flat, and it was just pretty bad. So, yeah, if they do it right, yeah, I would like to see him cover older topics. And for his side question, he asks, Do you plan on doing more live streams? I really enjoy discussing Power Rangers and Super Sentai with you and other fans. So, yes, I also had a lot of fun during that, and I do plan to do more live streams in the future. Just probably doing something more than Photoshop because that was kind of boring for me. But I actually had a lot of fun talking with you guys and I'm glad to hear someone else had fun too. So yes, more live streams will be coming in the future. Jarhead MSTR says, is Jujubee a reference to Bumblebee? Um, no, Jujubee is not a reference to Bumblebee, but maybe I'll talk about it more in the future if enough people want me to. Then he asks, when do you usually record your videos? What days? So, I really just record my videos when I need to get that audio for a video. Like, I finish one video, and I'm like, alright, what else can I work on? Oh, this video. Okay, well, now I need to go get the audio for this one. So, it's really just kind of whenever I have time, or whenever there's a lot of time to do so. So, I don't really have a specific time. It's mostly the weekends though, because the weekends, you know, you have a lot of time there. So if I had to give a straight answer, it's probably the weekends. His third question is, what will you do for 1,000 subs? Honestly, at this point in time, I have no idea what I'm going to do for 1,000 subs, because that seems kind of far in the future. So I don't have a set plan, but I'm hoping it's going to be something big or just a lot of small things. So, I don't have any concrete ideas yet. Maybe you guys can leave something down in the comment section for what you'd like to see in the future. And for his fourth question, he says, Are you actually elite? Movie Critic asks, Who is your favorite Gokaiger? So, I have not yet seen Gokaiger, so I'm just going to have to default to Captain Marvelous because he's the Red Ranger and I love Red. But I actually have a feeling that when I do eventually watch Gokaiger, he will still end up being my favorite character because he's marvelous. Haha. <laughs> His second question is Do you wish the Neo Saban Bandai Toy Line era toys had more quality to them? Yes, I do, because some of their products have this really cheap feel to them that I don't like. Most of the time, they look pretty good most of the time, but pretty much all the time they really have this cheap feel to them that just is, doesn't really feel great. So I wish, yes, I do wish they were improved or had more quality to them. The third question is if I watch Toku Nation, and I actually haven't heard of Toku Nation, the YouTube channel, so obviously, I mean, that means I haven't watched them or don't watch them. And for his semi fourth question, that's in a different comment, he asks, would you want to review Key Ranger episode 38 with me? So sure, I mean, email me or message me, or what's a good time for you, what's a good time for me, we can work something out, and yeah, I love to review an episode with you. 
So that brings us to the end of the 400 subscriber Q&A. Thank you so much to everyone that submitted questions and to everyone that helped me reach 400 subscribers and to all my page. I mean, I'm looking very forward to what's to come in the future. And if you haven't already, please consider hitting that big red subscribe button. And I hope to see you next time. Thank you for watching.